Did you do the buildings that like, I'm trying to picture these things, like at different times of the day? He did, mm -hmm. maybe, yeah, yeah, yeah. What was this, Barnett Newman? Well, anyway, he would find his geometries in everyday, everyday right. life, which is the way the modernists would look for their right. stuff. Right. And looking for it in pop culture is definitely something that belongs to the whole... What I think of postmodernism is that sure. is you know, pointing at everyday life through conceptual means versus the modernist thing of pointing at transcendent, right. which is God, right. transcendent uh, through material means. Sure. So in a way, you're, you're running a big time. Um, Post, late postmodern program, right? For for the sake of ab geometric abstraction. Yeah, yeah. Kind of. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Were there people in school that you're like, like, you know, or is this like? There's a because there's two things. One is the whole pop culture-ish thing, which is sort of natural, normal, right? Like. I think we all kind of grow up and say, okay, this is cool, this is cool. Right. This is my life, you know. Mm -hmm. So we'll paint this. And then there's like, uh, like all this hard edge abstraction stuff. Like, where did that, why, why, why are your soldiers fighting for that king? Well, I was always not, not uninterested, but at least like, or I say, I should say, I, I was interested in sort of because from that sort of uh, in that sort of attitude of, of of meshing these things together, you know, it's I wanted to be a bit removed, so to to not necessarily say, well, this is coming from me in my special eye. But this is what's there. You know what I mean? What's around us. Right. So and I think in that sort of with that sort of attitude. The geometric like they, extractions of these guys here, I mean they're somewhere in this I think they're they're between all of these things done in, in these books, in the the previous the boxing things, mm -hmm. the uh, the skateboard stuff, and then you did these guys, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, at least that was, yeah, that's where I was kind of coming from. I wanted as sort of little mediation, at least from a technical aspect of you know, pain application or handling. I, I didn't want them to be so personal, you know, where it, with this body of work, I'm sort of kind of embracing that, you know, and, and trying to... Because these are heroes here. In, in a sense. With a small age. Yeah, really small. Yeah, it has to be, right? <laughs> uh, I mean, in a way, in a way, it's, you know, the way I look at these find these sort of characters and reading about what they were into or whatever. You know, they all sort of strike a chord as these, you know, artists that are doing their thing and, and they have, you know, you feel some kind of like kinship with that. And especially when they are heroes with a small age and not uh, you know, they're not household names by any means.